All right, what's up everybody? This is Ram Shack. So today we're gonna be doing a max speed test with the Amada Crescendo. This is one of the most unique cars in this game. So be sure to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Help me get to a thousand subs. Hope we get there by the end of the year, <sighs> which is next year, whatever. Two thousand, whatever. I just want to get a thousand subs. So anyway, uh, we are doing a max speed test of the Amada Crescendo. This is a car we just won last week. This thing is the unique car because. It has 15 nitros or DOS in it. That is crazy. No other car in this game has that many DOS. Nothing has even close to that. Also, an interesting thing about this car is that its acceleration is incredibly fast, but its top speed is just is alright. It's not that great. It's kind of weird. It's weird how its top speed isn't like super noteworthy, but the fact that it has 15 DOS and crazy high acceleration. And it also is a little bit more durable and has a little bit better handling than the other Amadas. This is one of the best cars in the game in terms of just driving around. Because every time you die, you obviously get all your NOS back again. But, and you can, you can basically artificially increase your top speed if you're like annoyed that your top speed is stalled out. You just keep NOSing and you'll be good to go. You'll end up increasing your top speed for a little bit. Um, yeah, it's pretty interesting car with 15 nosses it honestly looks fantastic this car looks way better than the other Amadas it kind of doesn't look like the Amadas which is why I'm like confused how come they named it that I don't really know but it is an awesome looking car um, especially in black it, with the red stripes it is a very very pretty looking car um, it's got weird interesting vibes I'm not sure what I would call this car and has an interesting look to it but yeah its acceleration is amazing every time you NOS it feels like it just goes flying up in speed so that's I mean obviously it's supposed to do that but it feels like it's it's a little bit more pronounced with this car because its acceleration is stat is so high um, obviously the police car has acceleration this high but you can't NOS with it actually pretty much every car in the game that has that acceleration doesn't have NOS so this is one of the only cars in the game this is again why this car is so interesting is that it is the only car with that high of acceleration that can NOS, so you can see what that does. Like, you basically just launch your car speed-wise into, like, insanity. It just goes so fast. So, yeah, I really like this car. I think this is probably... I think the police car is overall probably just a better car because it's durable, and if you're doing races in this game, you're just going to hit crap. But I think in terms of just, like, funnest car to drive in the game, I would probably say this car because of the fact that it has 15 NOS that reset upon death so you get them all back and then just get to be basically NOSing the entire game like you basically have incredibly high acceleration that you don't like isn't statted but you have it you know what I'm saying so this car is incredible probably the best car utility wise in the game just because if you hit anything in the police car it's gonna slow you down but this car doesn't have that problem so um, it is a little bit weak because I just died, but you get all your 15 NOSes back right when you die. So, really can't complain about that, like, at all. This car is very, very good, and it's it's sad that we're getting near the end of this game. Also, this is another amazing car, so it's bummer that we don't get to really... I mean, we can use this car and stuff, but it's like, what would you use this for? <laughs> it's the, literally the last race you unlock. So... This is an interesting game in that this game actually promotes cruising because you unlock so much stuff near the end of the game that you actually do get to cruise more and you have to search the city for cruising. So they really did a good job with this game. Rockstar really nailed it. Rockstar was so, is, and is still, but just they're so good at making games. Even games like this are just so replayable and have so much that you can do. Games that, have, that make it fun to just kind of like roam around Pretty, pretty rare nowadays to find games like that so yeah this is the Amada Crescendo it's a very very good car I highly recommend getting it if you're gonna do a play through this game probably try to get this thing earlier because if you're gonna do all the bonus missions with this thing it's, it's pretty good but I don't think you can actually use it in any sort of real race in the game I mean maybe you could I don't, I don't know when those things get unlocked honestly it seems like those things, all the like bonus races get unlocked after you beat the game. So I think you wouldn't be able to use this car. If someone can let me know in the comments if that's not true. 
but it seems like you can only unlock this car, or only use this car in uh, certain races, which would be near the end of the game. That's just my opinion. I actually don't know if that's true or not. It just kind of seems like it, because all those... That dude just went straight through that tow truck. What the heck? Um, yeah. That's just my thoughts. Okay, now we're doing this thing again, where I'm going to be trying to get back in front. I don't know why that tow truck, is, or that tanker is just backwards. I'm not really sure what that's all about, but it's fine. But yeah, this car's really good. Probably the best car in the game in terms of hitting crap, because you're going to respawn and you have 15 nitros. So, really, really good stuff. Let's just get something to total my car. There we go. But yeah, very, very good car. Very fun to use. Incredible acceleration. Probably the best acceleration if you're nasty over anything else in the game. It's a J15. You should be. You basically should always NOS like three times if you hit anything. Just like stabilize your car, then just start using NOS. And then you'd be really good. So. Yeah, this thing's sick. Um, next up on our walkthrough here is we're gonna go find all those cars in London, all the secret cars. So I'll show you how to unlock those and do max B text tests for each one of those. Yep. So y'all great. Thanks for watching. Peace.